The realm. Do you know what the realm is? A story we agree to tell each other over and over till we forget that it's a lie. We copy you down, Eagle. Listen, uh... Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. In today's video, we're going to have a look at the footage broadcast to the public live around the world on television of the last minutes to the landing on the moon. The footage was not filmed by NASA, not created by Stanley Kubrick, and it also wasn't done by Disney. Throughout history, suspicions of fraud or conspiracy have surfaced in various fields, including archeology, span history, medicine, science, and the media. Over time, compelling evidence has emerged to vindicate these doubts the motive behind these deceptions vary widely. Mostly it's about money. In the pursuit of personal gain, the ethics of the few have tarnished the ethics of the many. For over six decades, a significant portion of the public has questioned the authenticity of what has been hailed as humanity's greatest achievement. Uncut footage sheds new light on these long-standing suspicions. In the lead up to what was billed as the most historic event of all time, set to be broadcast live on the telly, the year was 1969, and televisions were not a common sight in most households. Many families rushed to acquire a television to witness the moon landing unfold in real time. While a handful of American households boasted color television, the majority of the world tuned in on their trusty black and white screens. Families came together in anticipation. Those without television gathered outside shops. All were in awe to see the live broadcast of man landing on the moon. It is no wonder that so many firmly believe they witnessed humanity's giant leap. After all, they saw it happen live on the telly. On May 17, 2000, astronaut Buzz Aldrin appeared on the late night show with Conan O'Brien. Let's listen to what he said. Oh, well, let's yeah. talk about this, because this is fascinating. I remember very clearly, I think anybody who was alive at the time does, I remember my parents waking me up and we went down and we watched you guys land on the moon. No, which you was, didn't. No, you didn't. What? Because uh, uh, there wasn't any television. There wasn't anybody taking a picture. You watched animation. See, you associated what you saw with... I have very hazy memories. Yeah, I know. Huh? Buzz does not finish the sentence. Buzz tells Conan that he didn't see the guys land on the moon, that it was an animation. The moon landing was broadcast as a live event, etching itself into the collective memory. However, in this 2000 TV appearance, astronaut Buzz Aldrin contradicts this narrative. When Conan O'Brien recalled watching the landing with his parents, Aldrin interjected, stating, no, you didn't. You watched an animation. You associated what you saw with. He said, you associated what you saw with. This surprising remark shifted responsibility to the viewers, implying a misunderstanding. Conan and his family associated the footage with the live broadcast because that is what the world was told. On July 20th, 2019, marking the 50th anniversary of the United States moon landing, the official NASA YouTube channel treated viewers to a live stream of the final 29 minutes of the original footage. What made this occasion appear even more special is that the footage was presented in vivid colour. In the video's description, it reads, Join us for a trip down memory lane, starting at 4.02pm Eastern Daylight Time on July the 20th, 2019, NASA TV replayed the original footage of the 1969 moon landing. Relive the moment. It might appear that NASA TV played the complete original footage, but that was not the case. They omitted a portion at the end. So either NASA TV doesn't have the uncut version, or they deliberately edited that bit out. Now let's look at the footage in question, the uncut version. The version which clearly labels itself as animation and labels at the creators of that animation. 
Even one of the presenters acknowledged it. Along with this, it is the late 1960s, a time when animations were painstakingly hand-drawn and hand-inked. For comparison, a Disney feature film of that era took around three to five years to complete. While the moon landing animation wasn't a Disney creation, it likely required a similar time frame for preparation and production. Understand, this footage was a few years in the making. I'm now going to play the last uncut six minutes of footage and we will see who is responsible. And then I'll be back. I'll be back. Let's go. Altitude now 21,000 feet. Still looking very good. Are. This is the International Arrivals Building, Kennedy Airport, with a big display board there. Velocity down now to 1,200 feet per second. You're looking great, Doug. Disneyland Eagle. in California. Okay, I'm still on flu, uh, so we may tend to lose if we gradually pitch over. Let me try auto again now, see what happens. Roger. He's talking about the high gain antenna. Okay, it looks like it's home. Roger, we oh, got good, good data. Makes the job easier. Down to just 14 miles to go in four and a half minutes. Seven minutes, 30 seconds into the burn. Four and a half minutes left in this era. Altitude 16,300 feet. Oh, boy. This great the way the communication is working. Descent to fuel to monitor, over. 42. Altitude 13,005. Velocity 100 feet per second. Made it, uh, switch over time, please, just... Roger, stand by. You're looking great at eight minutes. Uh, correction on that velocity, now reading 760 feet per second. It's the P-64. 760 feet per second Roger. on the way down. <laughs> That's pretty slow for space flying. It is. It's as slow as man has ever flown in space. It sure is. Fido says we're go. Altitude 9200 feet. 830, you're looking great. They're just about Descent rate 129 feet per high second. gate. We copy. That's a 7,600 foot level. 1.4 miles high when they get down to a speed of 98 miles an hour, and they're just a little under five miles from the landing site. At that point, they can pitch forward, get a really good view. Eagle, of the you're looking site. great. Coming up nine minutes. That's that high We're gate. We're now in the approach phase. Everything looking good. Is there inside Altitude the high 50, gate? 5,200 feet. 5,200 feet, less than a mile from the moon's surface. Manual out of depth control is good. Roger, copy. Oh. Altitude 4,200. Houston, you're a go for landing, over. Oh, oh great go. I do understand, go for landing. 3,000 feet. Got an alarm. 3,000 feet, ooh. Go to landing, meaning they're on the spot. Roger, 1201 alarm. We're go, same time, we're go. 2,000 feet. 2,000 feet, into the egg, 47 degrees, roger, 47 degrees. Just these communications too, we're getting this readout perfect. Eagle looking great, you're go. Altitude 1,600. Oh, this is, they've got a good look at their site now. This is the, the critical time, they're going to hover, they're going to make a decision. Apparently they're low though. 1202, we copy it. 35 degrees. 35 degrees, 750, coming down to 23. What? 700 feet, 21 down, 33 degrees. Oh, the data is coming in beautifully. 100 feet down at 19. 540 feet down at 30, down at 15. And 400 feet down at 9. Stay forward. 
Altitude, velocity, light. Ten ass down. Two twenty feet. Fifteen forward. Eleven forward. Coming down nicely. Two hundred feet. Four and a half down. Five and a half down. Within sixty feet. Six and a half down. Five and a half down. Nine forward. Good. And twenty feet. Hey, 75 feet. That's looking good. Down a half. Six forward. 60 seconds. Ice on. Six. Down two and a half. Forward. Forward. Good. 40 feet down two and a half. Picking up some dust. Three feet, two and a half down. Big shadow. Four forward. Four forward, drift into the right a little. Eight. Down a half. Thirty seconds. Forward, drift. Eight. Contact light. Okay, engine stop. APA at a descent. Hold control, both auto descent engine command override off. And then I'm on. We're home. <laughs> 413 is in. Man on the moon. We copy you down, Eagle. Houston, uh. Oh, jeez. Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Roger, Twink. Tranquility, we copy you on the ground. You got a bunch of guys about to turn blue. We're breathing again. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Ooh. Oh, boy. Thank you. You're well. looking good here. <laughs> What? Okay, we're going to be busy for a minute. Mm. After I'm on, take care of the beach. I'll get this bucket back. While they say something, I'm speechless. <laughs> I'm just trying to hold on to my breath. That is really something. Very smooth touchdown. Kind of nice to be aboard on this one, isn't it? Mm. You know, we've been wondering what... what this guy Armstrong or Alden would say, the stuff put on the moon which comes a little bit later now. And just to hear him do it, we're left to absolutely with dry mouths and speeches. Hey, it looks like we're mending the oxidizer now. Roger, Eagle, and you are safe for T1. Over. Eagle, you are safe for T1. I just am safe for T1. Roger, and we see you venting the ox. It's a great simulation of what you can see there, if you could see us. <laughs> that little fly speck is supposed to be a lens. Yeah. <laughs> see, they must be in a perfect position, upright. We've heard no complaints about their position. Just they a land landed right in. Just a little dust. Even that concern was yeah. erased. Wow. And there they sit on the moon. Just exactly nominal, wasn't it? Exactly as a flight plan all the way down. Man planning this thing on the surface of the earth. I tell me. We're done. That's it's funny, it's too. Copy, uh, 960, 943. Roger, we have it. So, did they lie? Four times the footage declares animation. One. It says it's an animation. Two, it clearly states it is a CBS news simulation. CBS News. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it was CBS News. Three, it again shows on the footage that it was a CBS news simulation. And then if we listen to Walter Cronkite at the end, he states it was a great simulation. It's a great simulation of what you can see. It's a great simulation of what you can see. It's a great simulation of what you can see. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the animation Buzz Aldrin told you about. No one watched the moon landing live on television. 
there is a no live footage. Thanks for watching. Astronauts, do come on. Now.